The Appalachian Advantage plan is the simpler, better way to get the phone you actually want. Instead of paying hundreds of dollars up front, simply pay the taxes up front and a few extra dollars on your monthly bill and get the phone you really want. It's called the Appalachian Advantage and is available at Appalachian Wireless. The Hatfield and McCoy historic site spring cleanup will begin Friday, May 13th and last until Saturday, May 14th. Over the course of the two days, eight sites will be cleaned in order to preserve the history of the land. Tomorrow being uh, Friday the 13th, uh, we will be starting our annual cleanup of the historic sites uh, pertaining to the Hatfield and McCoy feud. We've done this annually for probably the last eight to ten years. Tony Tackett, Director of Tourism, and our commissioners and all uh, we wanted to do this for our community and for preserving history. That is our, that our heritage and we want to protect that. If you'd like to join us, you're more than welcome. Uh, it is work. And the main thing is, is I want to always to try to preserve our heritage. Uh, to maybe put a smile on a kid's face someday when they ask them where you're from, that they might say, I'm from the land of the Hatfield McCoys from Eastern Kentucky. The cleanup will begin at 1 p.m. on Friday the 13th at the Perry Klein Cemetery. From there, participants will move to Dill Cemetery. There will also be a number of historic sites to clean the following Saturday. We started the uh, cleanup on the historic sites, I'm going to say it's between 8 and 10 years ago. And actually, how did it get started? It was actually Tony Tackett, the Director of Tourism's idea, and uh, we both agreed and we've reached out for help, you know, for the community, this and that. Uh, but again, uh, it's something that we want to do. Uh, we're proud of those sites. We hope our community is proud of those sites. Uh, we have visitors from all over the world that visit these sites every year. And we try to keep those sites uh, maintained for best appearance. Bob hopes to instill a sense of pride in the people of this area by keeping these historic sites preserved and cleaned. As far as the cleanup goes, we'll be using tools naturally, power chainsaws, weed eaters, all that type of equipment. And every once in a while we get tired, but there will not be any feud or no fussing. For more information on how you can get involved with the Hatfield McCoy Historic Site Spring Cleanup, contact Pike County Tourism CVB at 606-432-432. 5063. For Mountaintop News, I'm Kelsey Dean.